Hi, I'm Patty Pavletti. I'm the Asia Regional Director for Global Footprint Network. Our president, Dr. Matis Walker Nagel, um, co-created the ecological footprint with Bill Rees. And what he saw was a real imbalance in the way um, humanity was using its resources. So he developed the ecological footprint accounting tool. And that basically tells us how much nature can provide, how much we're using, and who uses what. I think a lot of people, when they hear footprint, they naturally think of carbon footprint. What makes us unique is that we don't just look at carbon. We look at forestries, we look at um, agriculture, we look at fisheries, because the world doesn't operate in silos. The world is an ecosystem. So we take this comprehensive, holistic approach to looking at how we use our resources and how the Earth can renew those resources. I believe our organization serves every single person on this planet, but our target audience is national governments because the individual can only do so much. At the end of the day, it's our policymakers that create the policies that we follow. When I went into Asia as the Asia Regional Director, um, mostly all of the governments I met with had never heard of the ecological footprint. They were on the fast track to developing in their countries and increasing their GDPs. Um, now in the Philippines, we are working directly with the Office of the President, and that was not easy because I had to convince them um, that this is a tool that their country needed, that their people needed, not just for this generation, but for generations to come. So now we are working directly with the Philippines Climate Change Commission and they have included the ecological footprint into their national planning strategies. So when you look at news from Asia, say, and there's deforestation in Indonesia, or you see news about um, severe weather due to climate change, these are all due to one core issue. And the core issue is that humanity is using more than the Earth can renewably provide. The situation is pretty bad, and I think um, anyone who reads the news, who watches the news, sees the signs of it every day. They just don't know um, what, the, what the triggers are. Global Footprint Network has been really successful in building awareness about the ecological footprint. That's why you see the word footprint in, in lots of magazines. Um, the whole carbon footprint phenomenon came from the ecological footprint. But awareness is not enough. Awareness without action is nothing. With your help, we can create a true shift in the world. Sustainability is not just an environmental or moral issue. It's about the well-being of humanity and our planet. Thank you.